and the Yahudim were at Shushan, assembled on the 13th day of Adar, as well as the 14th day. And on the 15th day they rested in it, and made it a day of feasting and gladness. Therefore the Yahudim of the villages who dwelt in the unwalled towns who were making the 14th day of the new moon of Adar a good day of gladness and feasting, and for sending portions, gifts to one another. And Mordecai wrote these matters and sent letters to all the Yahudim who were in all the provinces of Sovereign Ahasuerus, King Xerxes, both near and far, to establish among them to perform the 14th and 15th days of the new moon of Adar yearly, as the days on which the Yahudim had rest from their enemies, as the new moon which was turned from sorrow to joy for them, and from morning to a good day, that they should make them days of feasting and joy, of sending portions to one another and gifts to the poor. And the Yahudim undertook to do as they had begun, and as Mordecai had written to them. But when Hadassah, Queen Esther, came before the sovereign, he commanded by letter that his evil plot, which Haman had plotted against the Yahudim, should return on his own head, yes, and that he and his sons should be hanged on the wooden structure. Therefore, they call these days Purim, after the name of Pure. Therefore, because of all the words of this letter, what they had seen concerning this matter, and what had come upon them, Yahudim had established and imposed it upon themselves and upon their seed, and all who should join them. Without fail, they should perform these two days every year, according to their writing and at their appointed time, and that these days should be remembered and performed throughout every generation every clan, every province, and every city, and that these days of Purim should not fail from among the Yahudim, and that the remembrance of them should not cease from their seed. And Queen Esther, the daughter of Abigail, with Mordecai the Yahud, wrote with all the authority confirmed the second letter about Purim. And Mordecai sent letters to all the Yahudim, to the 127 provinces of the reign of Ahasuerus, King Xerxes, words of shalom and truth, to establish these days of Purim at their appointed times, as Mordecai the Yahudi and Hadassah, Queen Esther, had established for them, and as they had established for themselves, and their seed concerning matters of their fastings and lamenting. And the decree of Hadassah, Esther, established these matters of Purim, and it was written in the book.